And here's a tutorial on how to use the calculator for uh, the railing uh, calculator. Just go down here, click on railing. And the purpose of this calculator is to help you quickly figure out how far apart the this, this little space here, D, you'll see D. This should ideally be the same distance from that edge of the baluster to the post as from this post to the back side of that baluster. If you do that, then the, the entire railing uh, span of balusters will appear balanced and be easy on the eye. It'll, it'll look proper. There's nothing worse than uh, slapping up a, a railing and not paying attention to the to the spacing here. You might in fact uh, want to tighten up the, the distance here of, of the spacing between the balusters if you want. But what you've got to do is is on a piece of paper make sure that you've you've identified the various uh, railing spans around your deck. Each side of a deck is a span. You've got to take that distance and figure out where your posts are going to be and 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 calculate the uh, distance enter in this case the distance between the inside face of each post so here let's let's just say we're going to go with uh, five feet uh, oh I don't know five feet seven inches okay and the width of the baluster is 1.5 inches and the spacing between the balusters is going to be let's say four inches okay now based on all of that information when we press calculate it's going to tell us what is this little space here between from post to post to the first and the last baluster and that, that means that you would position the entire uh, section of railings or balusters uh, between the posts according to those that spacing and that's helpful. Uh, otherwise, uh, you have to calculate this, uh, you know, on a piece of paper, and it can get a little, little bit math heavy. So um, here we know D. That's what we were looking for. D is 2.5 inches. So the rest of the spaces between the balusters here may, in fact, be four inches. But in this case, the last spacing and the first spacing between the posts are going to be two and a half inches. If you do that, you'll end up with a very balanced-looking railing section bunch of balusters that are nicely balanced in between those posts. So that's how you use this particular calculator. And it obviously, uh, a lot of times, the railing sections, the distance between each post will change uh, from one side of the deck to the next. So you have different spans. So with this calculator, you can input as up to, up to uh, three different sections, uh, three different span lengths between posts and just input it here and here and so forth. Um, that's how it works. Pretty, pretty straightforward. I think you'll find this one uh, helpful. Thanks for stopping by visiting us at ideasfordeckdesigns.com. If you have any questions or any suggestions that I can uh, put in, implement, uh, put into, into play that'll make the site uh, better for you, please do send me an email. I really appreciate it. And thanks again for stopping by.